Hi. Welcome to episode 13 of Backroom Basics. This is Kira Frost. My name is Aaron Lopez. We've been away for a little bit of a while because we were in transition, so thank you so much for being patient. Thank you. But here we are in our temporary digs of stocks and lawns, filming the Laverne and Shirley show <laughs> back here, old style, in front of our laptop. Mm -hmm. But not to worry. We will be reuniting with C Sharp Video for future videos because they were unbelievable. So much fun. So much fun. They were great. Yes. So, that. not to worry. We will be back to our super professional ways extremely shortly. But for our first video here at Stocks and Blondes, we didn't want to freak Bradley, the owner, out by bringing in her entire crew, which they were awesome, by the way. So, we're sitting in front of the laptop for this one. Behind the sinks. Yep. Front the sinks. <laughs> here we are. So, Shirley and me, Laverne, here today are going to be discussing men. Hello, men. Hi. Finally, I feel like this is a long time coming. It is. We've been it is. Trying yeah. to talk, but we've had all these other pertinent topics to talk about. So finally, it's we're true. digging into the men today. Yep. First yeah. and foremost, regimen. Let's talk about a regimen, men. Yep. It's not just about just shampooing, trying to get out of the shower as fast as possible. No, that's true. We need to, just like anything, have a system. So if your hair is not working, you need more manageability. Let's, let's talk about some conditioner for a second. Mm -hmm. If your hair is shorter than half an inch, Christopher Lopez, uh -huh. I will cut you some slack. You don't have to condition. But if you are worried about manageability, your texture is unruly, mm -hmm. if you have long hair, if you're it's in transition, dry. dry um, summertime, you've been baking out in the sun every weekend mm -hmm. on your surfing. boat, surfing, yep. skateboarding, Swimming. whatever it may be. Mm -hmm. You need some a little extra moisture. Yeah. So, condition, condition. You have to, and it can Just be lightweight. It doesn't have to be anything crazy. Oh yeah, you wouldn't have to. You don't have to become a chicken like mask and all that stuff if you don't no. want to. But you know, if you're, if you share a shower with a woman, chances are she cares about her hair and she's got conditioner in the shower. I hope so. So do I. Please, Lord. I hope so. <laughs> <sighs> Whew, sweating a little bit. So, use her conditioner. It, right. We don't care if it's matchy matchy right. to your shampoo because we realize you're a boy. The only thing we care about is that you're using it. Right. That's all we care about. So, use it. And, ex excuse me, <clears throat> two in ones don't count. And neither do three in ones. Much to my horror, my favorite. Boyd Line, American Crew, has a three-in-one. It is a shampoo, a conditioner, and a body wash all in one. And I am sorry, American Crew, as much as I love you, it's bad. I do love it. End of rant. You got all your zip box. You I got know. real close. I did. I got real close. Got real close. And I said it like I meant it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Two-in-ones. No. Okay. I've talked about it before, and I will say it again, especially in this video, because men feel like they use a two-in-one, and therefore it's all taken care of, and it's quick. But it's not true. Shampoo rinses out, shampoo shampoos out everything, including whatever they're claiming they leave behind, which is nothing. A film? That scares me. <sighs> Speaking of, yes, easy. Let's talk about product first. Okay. Yes. Oh, gel. Gel is not the cure all men. Yes. There's so many other products out there. That's true. That's true. Talking the tub about, o gel. Right. The tub o depth depth gel. Yeah. Or what oh. is it? Trace Flores gel. What? Yeah. Is that in Mi Pueblo? That is in Mi Pueblo. <laughs> and it comes in like the that o gel. Mm -hmm. No. Um, there's so many other products on the line. There are waxes. There's pomades. Mm -hmm. There's There are some suitable gels. If you're going to blow dry your hair, please, by all means, use it as a foundation product. Mm -hmm. But do not use it as a normal finishing product. Oh, no. Because no one likes crispy hair. Oh, you'll be so disappointed. Yeah. And your lady is going to want to run her fingers through her hair, and you're not. that's not possible with gel. That's right. That's it's disappointing. Right. So venture out there. Talk to your hairstylist. Talk to your friends. See what other people are using and what's suitable for your hair texture, your hair type, your length, and also what your um, specifications are. Mm -hmm. If you don't like anything sticky, if you don't like anything creamy, if you don't like anything stiff, mm -hmm. then those are the things that you talk to us about and you tell us, look, I don't want to use anything that smells like this or, you know, whatever. I want to smell like a girl. That's right. fine. 
That's fine. They're plenty Chances of are we don't want you to smell like a girl either. No, we want you to smell like a man. Yeah, that's or if you point. do want to smell like a girl, that's fine with us too. That, we can direct you in the right direction. Okay. We don't care. We can do that too. Yeah. We're very we're very flexible. Yeah, you just have to tell us. Yeah, we'll send you in the right direction. You just but have to ask. You have to tell us. Yeah. But no, gel as a finisher, that's bad. Fine. Yeah. The days of crispy crispy cream hair is over. Long gone. Done. Oh, yes. Done to it. Long gone. All right. Men, your hair is short. And therefore, it feels like it grows very quickly. And you come and see us more often, say, than your girlfriend slash wife. Don't moan about that. You, you're expensive. I mean, I hate to say it, but you're high maintenance. Even though you more high maintenance than they really think. It's true. And you're more high maintenance than your girlfriend when it comes to your hair cutting schedule. You probably, if your hair is short, need to come and see me or Pinky Lee here every four weeks. Don't deny the inevitable. Right. Sometimes six, if you can texturize, yeah, if you can that's texturize. why we're such huge advocates of texturizing. Because yeah. you can really yes. get that extra two weeks out of it, and then it's not such a financial commitment to us. Mm -hmm. um, and you don't want to see us every week. Four weeks. Yeah, you know that's fine. Every three weeks. That's crazy. That's yeah. crazy talk. But you if you're, see me every if you're super close crop man, if you are like way close, lean over the ears. If it is super close, if it is tapered neck, if it is high and tight as we call it, you're gonna see me every month. That's the way it is. Just accept it. Accept it. That's right. Okay. Schedule it out every four weeks like clockwork. This it's the way of the gun, kids. Way of the gun. Right. Or, if you're wanting to be daring and do something different, give us plenty of time, right? I always, my suggestion is wait as long as you possibly can to get a haircut. Because mm -hmm. that way when you do out. come in, we have more to work with. And it's not in three weeks you're expecting some sort of extravagant change. Oh, yes. Um, because I want to change. Because that's not going to happen. It's this long. Right. A centimeter change. Well, what kind of change are we talking about here? Sorry. Sorry, guys. Um, which leads me to my next point. Take a chance. Please take, take a chances. chance. Just like women, we've talked about take it. Take chances, drive fast. What? Don't drive fast? Whatever. You drive very slow. I do. I drive really slow. Have real you seen slow. my car? I she drive like fast. 15 billion pounds. I drive real fast. I drive too fast. Oh my. Yeah. Anyways, next time you see us, ask me about the first time I drove at this point. Anyways, we don't need to get into that. <laughs> I'm, still, I'm still horse. So we, um, my suggestion is it's a take a bit. chance. That's have, Nancy. That's Nancy. Isn't her hair pretty? She's beautiful. She's, She's totally great. Beautiful. Um, take a chance, gentlemen. F what your friends say, because I hear it time and time again from own personal experience. Mm -hmm. He's gonna kill me that I reference him. <laughs> but take a chance. I don't care what your friends say. I don't care that you want to take a chance and do something different and style something different and, you know, and your friends are going to make fun of you. They're probably jokes. Let's be real. Yeah. So, fuck what they say. Yep. Just like my advice to women, I don't care what your husband says. I don't care what your wives say. I don't care. Let's try something new because you only live once. YOLO. Yep. YOLO. <laughs> You're welcome. Yeah. Who cares? If you see something that you want, why not try it? Yeah. The worst case is that we cut it all off next time in yeah. three weeks. It's fine. And even then, hopefully, that's because you don't really like it or it didn't really turn out the way that you thought it would and not because some idiot said something like nasty about exactly. it. Exactly. I don't care. And even I don't then, care. who are they? No one. They're not doing your hair. They're not looking at you in the mirror every day. Yeah. You are. That's right. And that's who we care about, you as a client, not your yucky friends who obviously we need to find a new circle of friends anyway. I'm going to get in so much trouble for this. Oh my gosh, I know. Half of me wants to edit this part out. But nope, won't. but I won't. Because <laughs> as you all know, we just hit capture and run with it. Anything you want to add? I think that's it. We covered all our points. Thanks, Good. men, for joining us here on episode Thank Lucky you. 13. Lucky 13! Yep. Of Backroom Basics here at As the Curl Turns. Stay tuned for... I don't know what our next topic is. No. If any, you have any suggestions, please send them to us. Send them Love. to us as the curl turns .com. Until then, take chance, take chances. Nah. Don't drive too fast. Unless you're this one. And thank you so much for supporting as the curl turns. For our 
trials and tribulations. Yes. Thank you so much for joining us here at episode 13. It's about 9.56. Oh, I'm still...